It is still a developing situation at the airport in Fort Lauderdale, otherwise known as the Hollywood Airport. 13 people were shot. Five of those people are dead as a result of the shooting that occurred in the baggage claim area in Terminal Number 2. The alleged shooter is in custody, and NBC has identified him as Esteban Santiago, 26 years old. From He was born in New Jersey. The pictures that you're looking at are the tarmac because baggage area two, in Terminal 2 was evacuated, but then there were unconfirmed reports of sh uh, shots fired in Terminal 1. And they, I, they evacuated Terminal 1 and the parking garage associated with Terminal 1. But NBC's Pete Williams says at this point there is no evidence that additional shots were fired from Terminal 1. But out of an abundance of caution, we did see a very large police presence and response to those reports. So at this point, you have Terminal 1 evacuated, you have Terminal 2 evacuated, uh, and Terminal 2 serves Delta primarily, but also Air Canada. They have both been evacuated. There is a ground stop earlier for the Fort Lauderdale Airport. Incoming flights that were within 50 miles were allowed to land. However, additional flights that were airborne and further away from 50 miles are being diverted to other airports in the area, most notably Miami. A very tense situation there, and 13 people were shot, five of them dead. Uh, Esteban Santiago is in custody. Uh, the reports are that he was not fired upon by police, that he threw his weapon down, which is reportedly a 9 millimeter pistol, and laid on the floor and surrendered. The reports also were he had multiple clips, and he stopped to reload those clips as he fired on people in the terminal uh, baggage claim area of Terminal 2. So 13 people shot, five of them are dead. We're monitoring the situation. There will be a news conference shortly with the Broward County Sheriff's Department. They are running this investigation. Uh, the TSA has tweeted various things, but they are not in charge of the situation there. It's the Broward County Sheriff's Department. You're looking at a live picture there from our affiliate. Bill, I'll send it back to you. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.